Hey Sardonic, how you doing? Bushnomics here. Just got done watching your, uh, uh, Hope and Pisses You Off 2 video, the one where you express frustration that more people aren't upset that the, um, the Twin Towers or something or other hadn't yet been rebuilt, you know, after nine years. You make a couple of statements in this video, and I had to rewatch it a couple of times to make sure I understood what you were saying, but I think you were pretty clear. And so I decided to make a response to you, so here it goes. Uh, here are a couple of clips from your video, and then I'll address them in a second. No, it's not that I'm suddenly in favor of a giant shrine and indoctrination center dedicated to the ideology that brought down the two towers uh, being built uh, in such a place where it can look down upon where the, where the destruction was caused. Uh, it's not that at all. But what's worse, that this giant fucking monstrosity is being built in a manner that can, you know, in a way that can just look down on the uh, destruction that Islam has caused. The destruction Islam has caused? Really? Two dozen extremists hijack a religion as well as some planes, fly them into some buildings, try to fly them into some other buildings, and this is destruction that Islam has caused? For fuck's sake, can we stop conflating the extremists with the larger group? I've been thinking a lot lately about paedophilia and I'm quite excited because I've come up with a way to eliminate the phenomenon from society forever. Everybody just needs to stop having babies. I mean, if we were to implement a ban on reproduction right now, then in just 16 years time, voila, there'd be no more pederasty. Those two dozen odd guys on 9-11 did made the biggest contribution in the worldwide anti-Islam PR campaign in history. Certainly modern history. They have caused much of the Western world to equate Islam with terrorism. Sort of the same way that when a lot of people see a Catholic priest walking down the street, one of the first things that they think of is pedophilia. It's not a monstrosity. It's 13 fucking stories tall. That's not that big. For Lower Manhattan, that's nothing. It's not looking down on the World Trade Center. And can't, even if you're on the roof of the thing, you can't, you can't even see Ground Zero from there. It's two blocks away. How many times do we have to say this? Two blocks away, around the corner, facing north. It's not even facing south. Dude. I hear what you're saying about the frustration that the towers haven't been rebuilt. Well, one of the other things you say in this video is that you have respect for private property rights and that people should be able to do, you know, whatever basically is legal with their own property. Good. We agree on that. I hate to break it to you, but Ground Zero is private property. Obama has just as much business being involved, or I should say the administration has just as much business being involved in rebuilding Ground Zero as it has in rebuilding the, the football Jesus in Ohio that got bolted a few months ago. It's none in their business. It's private property, too. Okay? Anyway, that's all I had to say. Those are my points. I look forward to any response that you might make, although, as it is, your video is getting quite a few responses, so I wouldn't be surprised if you did a follow-up or something like that. So, y'all take care. Everyone else is watching, take care. Have a great day, have a great weekend, and all that good stuff. Be safe.